Ja, Hallöchen, Hallöchen, da sind wir auch mal wieder bei Life is Strange 2. Ja, zwischen Daniel und Sean ist es ja nicht gerade gut Kirschenessen gewesen, aber ich hoffe mal, nach dem kleinen Gespräch im Zelt ist es jetzt doch ein bisschen angenehmer geworden. Ja, Daniel fühlt sich halt vernachlässigt, weil Sean jetzt eher mit seinen neuen Freunden abhängen will, aber naja, was soll man machen? Der nächste Morgen. Total zugedröhnt. Ja. Ja, danke, liebes Spiel, dass du ihm noch die Bon hast nehmen lassen. Oh, oh fuck. Oh man, eh. Jetzt wohl noch gehen. Okay. This is boring. So, everybody, tell me how you're gonna blow your next payday. The usual. Save it till the next one. <laughs> well, ain't we all stingy now? How about a keg offering for your family, or... Or some hookers, or cocaine? Oh, please. There's a child here. Mm, I think he's heard worse. Besides, he's our mascot now. Oh, I want to buy a bacon burger, and a pepperoni pizza. Then, a box of Choco Chris, and, and a red slushie. Oh, hell yes. Screw the hookers. Bring on the Choco Chris. 
Come on, Sean. You gotta treat yourself after all this hard work. Hmm. Gute Frage. Ach, neue Zahnbürste. Maybe a new toothbrush for me and Daniel. I know you guys dig our morning breath. No. No, we all think it's really hot, actually. So that's it, huh? You bust your ass all week for nothing? Some of us just got simple needs, princess. Yeah. Like your beach house in Costa Rica? <laughs> Touché. <laughs> okay. Let's get this over with. Finn, Cassidy, Sean, and uh you. Jake. Jake Jacob. Na dann, auf zur nächsten Runde. Daniel, dude, do you have to do this every week? Adults only. Oh, whatever. I work too. Yes, I know. But we have to keep a low profile. Got it? For the millionth time. Just wait here for a few minutes. And don't do anything. Nothing. I won't. I swear. Okay. We'll be right back. Ugh. For once, you're all on time. Let's see who wins that farm lotto. Jacob, right? I thought you wouldn't last a day, but you cleaned up. You're all right. Thank you. Thanks. Cassidy, your trims were pretty weak. And Big Joe told me you've been whining a lot. I bet he did. Look, you can bitch all you want as long as you work. Otherwise, you're just taking up space. So get it together. I know, Meryl. Now for Sean. Very nice trims. Good work, kid. Finn, you saved the pots in the greenhouse. And our asses. That's why you keep coming back. You know it, boss. Uh, how about a raise? <coughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry. So good, we're not yet. Now for the moment you've all been waiting for. Get in here, you little asshole! What the fuck? Don't touch me, jerk! Don't move! Now explain! That sneaky fucker! He was snooping around your living room! No, it wasn't! I was just bored, so I came in! Uh, shut up, Daniel! Seriously! Let Shh. him go! I told you. Come on, Meryl! He's a kid, not a thief! You wanna frisk him? <sighs> Look at him! He's just following his big brother! Your brother needs a lesson. You all need a lesson. So first off, no payday. Uh, oh, fuck that. No us. way. Uh, don't do that to us. We earned that money. Sean, you and your brother are, are fired. What? And don't come back or Big Joe will take care of your ass. Please, Meryl. That's Bullshit, man! Man, I, I know you're pissed, but Sean is a good worker. Never brought you any losers, right? Sir, quiet! Shut the fuck up. Sean, I warned you one too many times. We tried your way, now it's my turn. Okay, Joseph, just teach him a lesson. Uh-oh. Ich habe ein ganz mieses Gefühl. Let me go! Come on, man. Big Joe, what are you gonna do? He's just a little fucking kid! This ain't your business. Think I like it. It's mine. Ja, scheinbar schon. Oh! Ow! Wow. What? Okay. Okay, who did that? Who did that? Uh, I did. My fault. 
Look. Wow. Ich hoffe, du bist dankbar dafür, Daniel. That's it. Believe it or not. Told you it would sound crazy. Fuck. That's mental. Exactly. I knew something was up with you guys. Damn. I would be scared shitless. We're careful. I'm always here. In case anything happens. And I practice every day. Man. So Sean. Maybe this shit is in your DNA too. Do you have a superpower? Yeah. Dealing with Daniel. Shut up! You're lucky you're my brother. Do you have any idea where it comes from? I mean, it can't be random. Yes, I left you, Luis. I figured it started in Seattle. Maybe. The shock triggered something. Fuck, I don't know. But... I still don't remember. Don't worry about it. Damn. You're so unique, Daniel. That's why I need your word that you'll keep all this to yourself. Seriously. Oh, this stays right with us. Promise. You can trust us. Jake? I don't know. I mean, this is a big deal, Sean. How long can you keep this a secret? As long as we have to. It's all about keeping Daniel safe. That's my job now, man. What if he has those powers for a reason? Maybe it's our job to help him too. Guide him. What does he mean, Sean? Dude, no. Do not make this into some cosmic bullshit. You still can't tell anybody. Come on. I wouldn't do that to you, Sean. Or Daniel. Oh, this whole thing just blew my mind. I think I need a break. Is that okay? No worries. It's cool. Oh, not after what you guys went through with these bastards. Okay. Talk later. He's right. It's fucking bullshit. I know. Finn, do you swear? I mean it. No worries, sweetheart. I'd never let anything happen to that little guy. <laughs> He's a true rebel. Thanks, man. For real. Ah, uh, hold up. You know, there's a lot of money around here. Oh, no. What the fuck are you talking about? Meryl's safe. It's like a fucking ATM. I've seen it. Me too. In the back of the room. How oh, are you man. outlaws gonna get the combination? Me? No fucking way, Finn. Don't pull a kid into your stupid shit. Ugh. Getting a shitload of cash isn't stupid. We can get out of here. So you can be a beach bum? You're so selfish, man. How? Sean and Daniel are out of work. They deserve this. And ripping Meryl off is the only way to do that? Really? And with a fucking kid? You know these assholes are armed, right? I guess. I didn't think about that. Yeah. No shit. <laughs> Don't lecture me. I was just having a brain fart. Let's have a beer and forget about it, Sean. Cool? Deal. Not like I would let you use Daniel anyway. No more of this crap, okay? Not really so he just needs his ass kicked once in a while. I think you did. I can tell he was sorry. For him? Yeah. 
Damn. I'm gonna drink the crap out of this party. So should you. Plus, since it's your last night, time for your tattoo. Und ihn da im Wald jetzt auch noch ein Tattoo stechen? Dude, I want one. No, you don't, hipster. We have other things we gotta do. Oh man. Okay. I know I shouldn't have gone in there. Don't yell. Now there's three more people who know about your power. Don't worry. We can trust them. They said they won't tell. I know, but what if anyone gets scared and calls the cops? You don't know what can happen. I'm not scared of cops. I can stop them any time I want. Jeez, Daniel. It's not... At least, this will all be behind us once we reach Puerto Lobos. Who cares about Puerto Lobos? We'll talk later. Oh, man, oh, man. I have the feeling that Daniel will have a bad end if it's going on. Okay. Guess everyone's expecting me. Better hit that party. Ah, that's your friend. Have a seat. Have a beer. To our last night together, and to your next adventure. Dann Prost. So, what are you gonna do next? <laughs> Figure out what I'm gonna do. Me and Daniel are homeless again. Yeah. Well, <laughs> when I got out of jail, <laughs> I had nobody but me. My brothers were still in the joint. <laughs> they still are. I stayed with a friend. Nobody could find me. Yeah, then I just said, fuck it. Took off. <laughs> that was it, man. No more family. Just me. Always trying to find a new daddy. Or new bros. Yeah. Stupid. I knew I had to cut everything off. Start over all for myself. That's what you're doing. Yeah, you're starting all over. And now, you just gotta take the next step to build a something for you and Daniel, right? Build what? Daniel's acting like such a punk. He doesn't want to listen to me. <laughs> I'm like a parent now. True. But he's still a kid. So, let him hit puberty. You can't stop it. <laughs> Just accept it. Yeah. Oh, it's gonna be all right, laddie. You uh, have enough cash for the trip? I doubt it, but we'll see. Hey, it's bullshit after all this. You deserve the lotto for life. Seriously. How are you two gonna get to Mexico? Hitchhike? Walk. Hey, just hear me out, man. There's only one way out of this for you. One way to hook yourself up. Listen, we got this, Sean. Daniel can open that safe with his eyes closed. Come on. No, Meryl's probably wasted, like every night. You guys can get to Puerto Lobos in style. With a, a nest egg? You don't want Daniel to be homeless anymore, right? Huh? Then let's do this. I wouldn't let you in on this if I had any doubt. Oh, God.